What's up guys, my name is GamerTos and welcome to another episode of Minecraft uh, Minecraft Survival. Uh, I said Minecraft again. Uh, this game actually isn't crap, but yeah, in this episode, I thought we were gonna, like, mine out some stuff in this uh, ravine. So yeah, I hope it will be at least, at least, at least a little bit of, a little bit enjoyable for you guys to watch. But yeah, I actually need some materials. I need some coal. I need some iron. I actually I don't need iron. I need some. Yeah, I need some coal. And of course diamonds, because I everybody needs uh, diamonds. Duh. So yeah, I'm just gonna quickly mine up this uh, like stack of coal, and then we're gonna move further down into the cave, ravine, or whatever. Whoa, somebody just mined out this part. So, I guess there won't be that much iron. What the fuck happened? Uh, like, on top here, because somebody just texted me. No, it's just Steam update. Fuck. Okay, let's just quickly update that. But yeah, so I see that this ravine isn't actually that small. It's actually two ravines like connected to each other but yeah I guess there won't be much iron in here since somebody's already been here so let's just go into the game of the cave and let's move further down uh, come on I hate water uh, so yeah looks like he the guy that was here before explored like the hole um, mine shaft. So there's no point in me going there. Okay, so I can't mine this. Okay, awesome. Oh, so actually he left some iron behind. Okay, awesome. That's good. Okay, and it looks like uh, the fortune doesn't work on iron. I don't know. Maybe it does. But it didn't drop. Let's get some coal. So I'll need that to smelt the iron that I get. Oh my god, really? 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 You're gonna do these? You're gonna do these? And I still haven't got that much food, so. We're gonna have to, like. Whoa! What the hell? Okay, hello there. I don't want to fall in this hole, so gonna patch it up and let's move further down. Uh, and it looks like I've ran out of torches. Oh my god, I I didn't grab any woods. Ah, oh, that's so stupid of me. Oh yeah, let's quickly grab this iron. Okay, so we can't mine this out. Oh, I hate water. It's like the most annoying thing in caves. Uh, so there's the hole. Oh, there's some more iron right here. How much did we get already? 13 pieces. Okay, that's good. And I didn't turn on the music. Why? Why? Why didn't I do these? Why didn't I do these? Okay, Spotify just stopped working. Well, screw that. We're not gonna go with music in this episode. It's gonna be a music free episode. Awesome. Okay, so the guy has already explored this part. He hasn't explored the ravine that much. At least it doesn't look like it because there's no torches and there's some iron right there. I saw it. Uh, some spooky, scary skeletons living in this mine shaft. Okay, it doesn't look like the Fortune 1 works on. Uh, like uh, iron and stuff so at least it works on diamonds so that's good we're gonna get more diamonds out of it oh my god this guy just left a bunch of coal behind him uh, and I need the freaking torches so I'm gonna fucking go home uh, grab like 12 pieces of normal wood turn it into 
planks and ba beam ba boom ba bam karim karam boom done I should actually grab some food oh yeah I don't have any food ha <laughs> fuck and the farm is actually growing so that's good okay shouldn't be sprint jumping just because it takes more food Come on, go down, go down to my ship. And let's explore this. Since the guy hasn't been here yet. Boom! Die, you spooky skeleton. I can hear a baby zombie. Hello, baby zombie! Hello, hello, little fella. And you're dead. That's good. Some bats, nothing here. Okay, so there was nothing here. Oh, there's some iron. How did I miss that? Does the fortune actually work on iron? Don't think so. Yeah. And I'm already low on food. What the hell? Like, seriously, the food goes down super fast. Ba -bim -ba -bim -boom -boom. Um, it's gonna be a pretty boring episode since nothing's gonna happen. At least I don't think so. In, in, maybe I can fall into some love or make some action out of that, but yeah, otherwise there won't be anything happening. I'm just gonna go mine for, I don't know, 20 minutes, then I'm gonna go back up, I'm gonna end the episode, and I'm gonna play some Counter Strike. Yeah! I love Counter Strike. Um, okay, so he left lots of things behind, like lots of iron, okay, I don't know who, who mines, like, all, who goes, who goes down into a cave and doesn't mind an, anything, mine, mine, what the hell, I can't speak, okay, la pus la police, and some lag, okay, Okay, so I'm gonna mine the iron with the normal pickaxe since it's a waste of fortune for iron even though it doesn't drop like the fortune does, just doesn't work on iron. Okay, and I'm gonna go further down this way. Okay, awesome, more iron. This cave is full of iron. That's good. I'm gonna be able to make myself an anvil. So I can later on repair the fortune one pickaxe. Okay, so the guy was here. And he was here, there's nothing here, yep. So, actually let's go back because I saw, like, that we could go left and right. Somewhere right here, like. And I saw some iron over there, so that's good. Look, a flower! A freaking flower on the ground, awesome. I don't know, before in like the early Minecraft days, it was like so rare to find a, fro a flower, flower in a cave, and now it's like everywhere, I don't know why. Really? And I think I'm gonna... I'm only gonna be playing on 1.8 since, as I've seen, 1.9 is like, I don't know, it's like, too much things, like, oh, it's super weird, you get, you have the wings, you have all those different stuff that just makes it, it just makes Minecraft a lot easier than it was, like, a long time ago it was super hard, like, you didn't have the food, uh, food, so you had to, like, so instead of uh, replenishing food bars, it actually was replenishing your health, so the health didn't regrow and stuff like that. Oh, and it was super hard, it was awesome though. I miss those old days. And it looks like he hasn't explored this part yet, okay. Oh my god, and the lag is real. 
Okay, so I think this is gonna be actually the only episode where you guys will see me mining because otherwise I'm gonna be mining off camera just so it's not that boring and so we have some fun stuff to do instead. Oh, look at this! A chest! And only some coal and some watermelons. That's good, I'm gonna grab this. Because who knows, maybe we'll need that. I don't know for what. But I just grabbed that. And the lag is real. Like the lag on the server is so annoying. I get it, it's like there's many people playing on the server. So, yeah, oh yeah, and the efficiency pickaxe doesn't work on. Oh, really? Somebody put. Ah, oh, That's so stupid. Okay, so there's nothing here. And the lag is real. Can't place blocks there. Like, who the fuck puts a cuboid? And doesn't build a house. Close to it or in it. Okay, I'm not gonna grab those tracks because... I won't be needing those. At least not for now. And... Ooh! We got us some bread, some redstone, some coal, and some fucking pumpkin seeds, and a diamond! That's good. Okay, so we have food now. That's good, because I was actually about to starve to death. Actually, I don't think you can starve to death on this server. Oh my god, there's a lot of iron. We already have a stack, don't we? Yeah, we do. Oh my god, the lag is super real. Oh look at this! The lag is real. Oh my god, really? Come on. See, this is why I want to do the mining off camera, because uh, it takes a lot of time to mine out one piece of freaking iron. It takes so fucking long. And I'm so sorry for all the swearing. But it's fun. It's fun. Come on. Okay, good. And we found ourselves a spawner. So, actually, what I, I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put torches around it. I'm gonna make this part out. And later on, I'm gonna do a freaking uh, XP like grinder and stuff like that around it. That's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be good. For getting like experience. Okay, so what I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna quickly make a jukebox, <coughs> place. Oh my god! Okay, Steam just launched. Wow, that took a long time. Okay, but yeah, with this diamond I'm gonna make a jukebox just so nobody can mine this uh, thing out because that will be so freaking annoying if it, somebody actually comes here and mines this out okay so now we have a cupboard right here I'm gonna quickly plus F3 and later on I'm gonna save those coordinates just so I know where to find it oh yellow skeletons are actually super stupid. Oh, I die. Okay, good. Super good. Oh, look at that. There's some mob money. 
Okay, but let's block the water. It's so annoying. It's like slows it down so much. Okay, so we got one dollar out of that. Actually, how much money do I have? I money. Okay, I only have one dollar. I thought that that I had more. Wait, apparently not. Look at this, more skeletons. Okay. So suddenly everything started to spawn again. What the fuck? Oh my god, and the lag is super real. It's not actually me lagging, it's the server. Like, I could seriously type in chat, like, who's lagging, and like 20 people would answer. That, oh, I'm lagging, I'm lagging, and there would be probably one guy that says, oh, buy a better internet then. Like, what the fuck? Oh yeah, I remember the story where I was playing CSGO and my friend, he had like a big thing, like it wasn't his internet because his internet was working fine. I think it was something with the steam on his PC that made him get like a big ping because normally he gets like 30 ping and stuff like that. So it's pretty good. But yeah, this one day he had like this one 1000 ping, sometimes he went up to 2000 and there was this guy that instead of like being like oh he has big ping let's actually kick him just so uh, we have a bot instead of like the pinger but no instead of that we got a guy that was like oh buy a better internet my internet is so much better he was like super annoying he was like I was I was telling him it's not his internet, it, it's uh, like uh, something with Steam that is messed up and he was just like, oh buy a better internet then. And I was just like, what the fuck, I just told you it's his Steam, not his internet, and he was, uh, and he was still complaining buy a better internet. Like, what the fuck? And he was, and he kept saying like, my internet is so much better than yours. And I was just like, okay. Okay, your internet is better, who cares? He was just like, oh, you care, you care, I have better internet, I have more money, you're poor. I was just like, what the fuck? Okay, yeah, I am, I maybe am poor, but who cares? And I just keep playing the game, and was, he kept on saying that his internet is better, that he's better than me, then... I don't know, from my friend, instead of complaining on my friend, he was complaining on me. Like for, it started up with my friend that he had big ping that he should buy a better internet, but then it suddenly changed to me. Like what the fuck? And I got super mad at that guy. Like really, I got super mad, and I wanted to kick him, but he had a friend with him, so we couldn't actually kick him. So yeah, we got super annoyed. We lost the game just because of him. Like every time I died, he was like screaming, oh you're so bad, even though I was first on the list, my stats were better than his, he was still like, oh you're such a noob. And I was just like, what the fuck man, why you gotta be so salty? <coughs> and guess what? There's another spawner. Oh my god. Or is there? Where's the spawner? Okay, so, but yeah, it was super salty, and what we ended up doing is, actually, I tried to kick my friend, but the guy that was salty, he didn't want to, me to kick him, so it's, he was, like, voting no, even though my friend had a really bad ping, and we would be in, we would have been better off with a bot, and my friend was also on it, so he was just like, yeah, just kick me. I'm gonna try to fix it and then we can play another game. But no, that motherfucker just didn't want me to kick him. Like everybody was voting voting yes, but that one guy just kept voting no and everybody on our team was saying just kick him already and stuff like that. And he kept on pressing no, what the fuck? Like, really? We could have won that if it wasn't for that salty ass motherfucker. I don't know why I told you this story, so it probably wasn't that good. But who cares, it's a story. It's a story, it's a good story, it's about vodka. There was no vodka. What do you mean no vodka? There's always vodka. 
Oh, <coughs> oh yeah. I remember like, oh my god. I was just like, when I first started playing CSGO, I was just like, uh, I asked my friend because he was playing a lot of CSGO and he was just like, oh, there's a lot of salty Russians on this, in this game. Like, there's seriously, when you when you find a full team of Russians, they will probably kick you out and stuff like that, that will be salty. And when I bought the game, I actually didn't find any Russians. Like, there was no Russians in the, like, I was playing for two months and I didn't see not even one Russian. And I was just like, what the fuck are you seriously telling me that there's lots of Russians and then there's no Russian? Okay. <clears throat> but then, uh, as I said, that I actually got into a full Russian team and they kept on speaking Russian. So I was just like, hey man, can you speak English so I can understand you too? And he was just like, fuck you. What? And I was just saying, whoa, 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 I'm just trying to be like nice to you and communicate. <clears throat> but he was, he kept on saying, no, fuck you, vodka, Russia, Putin. Well, I like. <gasps> but yeah. <clears throat> so I had to freaking stand out with the guy, with the guys who was full Russian team, so it was. Like super annoying, like they all kept speaking in Russian, I didn't understand anything. Every time I was the only one left, I was just like, could you guys give me some info where the enemy sat? And they were just like, no, fuck you. And I was just like, okay, okay. Oh, we have two stacks of iron, awesome. Uh, but yeah, they <coughs> kept saying no, they kept being salty, and I was just like, okay, so the Russians in this game are actually really salty. <coughs> Those guys that I met, the full team was, they were the saltiest Russians I've ever met. But yeah, I found the next game. I played with a normal team of English people, some someone from Bra Brazil, and some other people. Okay. Okay, awesome. Okay, that's good. Can't place you. Ah, oh, fuck. But yeah, so I played with normal people, and then the next game, I played with a Russian again. I was just like, oh, I bet he's gonna be salty too. But no, this guy was actually the nicest Russian I've ever met. He was like communicating in English. He followed like all the rules, like being nice, like saying some compliments. Even if I failed like super hard, he was still like, yeah, man, no problem. <clears throat> and I was just like, oh, wow, you're actually super nice. And yeah, it ended up that we talked a lot, we had fun, we kept singing like Russian songs, so I don't know why. But I was just like, okay, so you're Russian, can you some Russian words? And he was just like, yeah, sure, what do you want to know? And I was just like, everything. Like vodka, Putin, balalaika, and kalinka. <laughs> so yeah, <clears throat> it ended up being super fun. Like, the other teammates were also in this like... We're also talking to us. It was super awesome. It was super nice. But then, of course, nothing lasts forever. So after the game, I got into another Russian team with that was salty. But yeah, I actually, uh, I would actually like to freaking add that guy on Steam because he was like super awesome. He was super nice. <coughs> he helped us out. Yeah, because he was actually the best one on the team. Yeah, he was super nice. I like that guy. So shout out to you, my friend. I don't know what his name was. I bet he doesn't know my name either. So yeah. And then also I met lots of Polish friends on CSGO. So wow! CSGO brings people together. Actually don't. No, it doesn't. Actually sometimes it does. But not all the all time. Uh, but yeah, I met a lot of Polish friends on there. Like, some of them were super nice, some of them were still kids, which, uh... 
Um, I, I accept their friend offers just because, like, I don't want to be mean. But, yeah. So, I have this, like, lots of these kids <coughs> that are playing CSGO, and there are, some of them are actually super annoying, like, there was this one dude that I played with, he's, I don't know from, uh, where he's from, but we played with him, I actually, he was actually just like, uh, hey bro, wanna play? I was just like, yeah, sure, okay, I, di I didn't know who it was, I didn't know he was the kid that was like super annoying, and I don't know why I still have him in my friends, but I think he actually blocked me, because the latest game I played with him, he was like, uh, that guy... Yeah, just like a kid, you know. So we were playing, we were playing, and then suddenly he does this like 11 year old thing where he starts complaining on everyone, how everyone plays. He doesn't complain about me playing, he complains on the other teammates. So yeah, actually I'm gonna head home. <coughs> I'm gonna... Oh fuck. I'm gonna put some stuff back. I'm gonna grab this. Gold. Do I have some more iron that I need to smelt? It doesn't look like it. So I guess I've already smelted all. And I'm gonna put the iron in for the smelt. So I'm gonna put back some pumpkins. It's um, the wood, cobblestone, melon seeds. Ds, ds, and ds, and ds, of course. <coughs> but yeah, he was like this kid that was super annoying and what happened is the teammates that I played with were like oh let's just kick him and I was just like man I don't want to do this but actually the ride is super annoying so bye have a day time <laughs> and, he, and after that he was just like oh, why did you kick me I thought we were friends I thought that we would play together and stuff like that and I actually said the honest thing to him that Man, actually, you were super salty, you were annoying, and yeah, sorry bro, but don't think I'm gonna play with you anymore. And he got super mad, he got, I don't know if he got like, um, I don't know what's, um, he, if he started crying or not, but yeah, from the text that he sent me, it looked like he was like super sad, super like angry. But yeah, I hope that's that dude's fine. What the hell? Okay, that was a glitch. <clears throat> so yeah, let me quickly do warp Garchma. And I'm gonna end this episode right here. Uh, there's actually a lot of stories that I would like to tell you guys, but yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did, leave a dislike if you did, uh, and leave some comments about what I should do in the next episode, since this time, seriously, I don't know what I should do. I could, like, fix this uh, barn, I could destroy that, but actually, I could, I would love to do destroying, like, this thing off camera because that's super boring like, watching me destroy things actually I could tell some more stories once I do that but yeah leave a, li uh, leave a like and stuff like that subscribe for more videos I'm gonna try to be uploading daily videos I don't know how that's gonna work out oh look at the the wit has grown the wit has grown and we only get one seed what the hell that's super bad okay <clears throat> so yeah hope you guys enjoy have a great time, and see you guys later. Bye.